good road conditions, no distractions, even driving under the speed limit and still an accident can happen just like that. The video sent to CBC News is a disturbing reminder to drivers. The moose, tough to see, quickly darts out in front of the vehicle and within two seconds smashes into the windshield. Amazingly, the driver wasn't injured. It's a hair-raising situation that makes any driver uneasy. I was just wondering if you would mind taking a look at the video and just telling me what you think about it. Oh. It's not much you can do there in that case. Yeah. That's just a case there where it's absolutely nothing you can do. He wasn't going fast, he was he could see, but the moose just shot out in front of him. Just one of those things. Oh gosh. <laughs> what do you think? Oh, just I guess it just kinda shows you how fast it can happen. Wow. That's fast. Yeah. Yeah, they come up on the road pretty quick, eh? Yeah. What do you think of that? Well, you don't have a chance. Yeah. yeah, there's not much you can do when a moose jumps out in front of you. Yeah. Just run into it. And while moose collisions are often hard to avoid, there are some things you can do. Jim Brazel is a defensive driving instructor, and I caught a ride for some tips. So one of the things we will advise our students to do is, is drop back their speed. And the reason for that, two things. The force of impact gets greatly reduced because of the kinetic energy being reduced in that vehicle. And also your peripheral vision gets stronger with a reduced speed. But I always say to people, if I'm driving nighttime especially, you have two lanes here. What I'm going to try to do as a driver, especially if I'm not impeding anybody, is actually get towards the center because it provides you now with more space from the side.